the long walk hurdle is next. And we've got a massive field for this. There's plenty of newcomers and plenty of trainers double handed as well. Three miles and one furlong, grade one event. And a top bag of tricks for Stu Gray. Cottage Wine, Craig Beckwith, Dance of the Animals, Joshua Sutherland, Dreaming Mist, Leon Van Rensburg, Huntsville Club, Vinnie Gerard, Petoskey Blur, Stu Gray, Pompey King, Vinnie Gerard, Specky Garson, and Vertical Blue for John Morgan, Wolverine, Darren Thompson, Zara Zeus for Padre Hogan, Dance Around the Stars, Joshua Sutherland, Dying of the Day, Padre Hogan, Extreme Consequences, Leon Van Rensburg, Four Wins in the Last Five, Gade Bridge, Darren Thompson, Penelope Pitstop, and Rapunzel for Martin Little, and Seminal Word for Alex Cherry called in and away and a long way to go and a lot of them to go that way as well as Specky Garson leads into the first if they all get over okay and John Morgan is top and tail in the field at the minute with Specky Garson in the lead and Vertical Blue at the back heading towards the second of the 14 then and Specky Garson's got a good four length lead there's a line of about eight or ten of them sharing second. We just dance of the animals. Rapunzel is close up, so to Petoskey Blur and Bag of Tricks. With Huntsville Club in the two shades of green, also close up as well as they get over the third. And Specky Garson is clearing the lead. Rapunzel is second. And then dance of the animals, Petoskey Blur. And Cottage Wine after that one, one of these caught quite wide on the track. But it's Specky Gas on the lead, probably a name that wouldn't be allowed in real racing. I dare say they think the word Specky is probably derogatory for when we wearing spectacles, but I don't know, maybe it means something else as well. But we've allowed it, it's okay. Specky Gas on in the lead. It's a lot safer than sort of Derek Hinton's names anyway, let's put it that way. Uh, Specky Garson's in front. From Dance of the Animals second. Then Petoskey Blue and Rapunzel. And Vertical Blue, who's made a lot of ground after starting really slowly. Penelope pitched up on that one's inside as they take the fifth. Which they're all over safely, although once again, Vertical Blue didn't jump it well and is now shuffling back down the field again. But a big, big field here and only one grey, which is a bit of a surprise. And Gray is Gade Bridge, you can just see poking his head in the shot towards the back of the field. But it's Specky Garson in the lead. Leading by four or five to Dance of the Animal second and Rapunzel third. And Petoskey Blur is fourth. So they take the sixth. So they all get over nicely. Gade Bridge continuing to be the Back marker, the only grey in the field as they come up the straight then. Got a complete circuit of the track still to go. And Specky Garson for John Morgan. Leads over the seventh. On Dance of the Animals and Rapunzel together in second. And Cottage Wine has moved through to fourth. On the inside of Petoskey Blur, wide on the track, Vertical Blue. He's trying to get back into it again. Pompey King is also getting closer, so to seven or word. Penelope pit stops drop back a little bit. Once creeping up nicely up the inside is die another day in the yellow and black as they pass the wooden post then with a full circuit ahead of them. And Specky Garson continues to lead by four to five lengths. Dance of the Animals, Rapunzel, Cottage Wine, and Vertical Blue again. All in a line share in second. Then Petoskey Blur and Pompey King. Die another day now is near side the orange sleeves and the blue cap of Seminole Word on the inside of Penelope pit stop in the maroon with a yellow cap. In the first of Darren Thompson's Wolverine in the maroon. Leon's two are racing pretty much together, although they're separated across the way of the track. They get over the eighth and Specky Garson. Undisputed lead all the way so far. Must be going well enough in front. We're on Cottage Wine and Rapunzel and Dance of the Animals. Pompey King is getting closer as well, and beginning to bunch up behind this leader there. And I would say the leader's got three lengths on Dance of the Animals, who's probably only got five lengths on the back marker. Seminal word as they get over the tenth. With Specky Garson still in the lead. And Wolverine Gadebridge has come through from nowhere to take a share in a second now as well. Rapunzel still there, dying on the day. As 
still he's still holding on to his position although stable mate Zara Zeus is getting closer as well Seminal Word is the one who's just a back marker dance around the stars and Penelope Bitstop have also dropped out of the back a little bit so too's Spatoski Blur seven furlongs to go and finally Specky Garçon's headed as Wolverine takes it up Wolverine then has come through the lead by about a head to Specky Garçon who's fighting back on the inside then they get up to Gade Bridge and Rapunzel as they get over the 11th and they're really beginning to bunch behind these leaders now it's wide open this one and it's Wolverine and Specky Garçon from Dance of the Animals in third then Dying of the Day and Zara Zeus Gade Bridge the Grey then getting close to his Dreaming Bridge Bragger Sticks is still there as well then comes Rapunzel Huntsville Club trying to get into it as well over the third last they go and Specky Garson's got back into the lead Specky Garson from Wolverine in second Zara Zeus wide on the track is third Dance of the Animals under pressure Dying of the Day is still there now Dance Around the Stars is coming around the inside to come through the challenges around the one that switched to the inside is Vertical Blue but that's got a lot of ground to make up it's Specky Garson who's in the lead again from Dance Around the Stars in second then Gade Bridge and Wolverine then Dance of the Animals, Zara Zeus is next going around the outside, Cottage Wine is trying to get into it, Dreaming Mist is still there over the second, last they go and Specky Garson still in front, from Gade Bridge in second, Dance Around the Stars and Wolverine probably between these with Wonder Jump it's Specky Garson holding on at the moment from Gade Bridge the Grey who's now beginning to assert up the centre of the track over the final flight they go, Gade Bridge landed just in front, here come the Van Lensburg pair Extreme Consequences and Dreaming Mist but but it's Gadebridge in the lead, full on the go. Gadebridge is in front, extreme consequences in Dreaming Mist, powering up the centre of the track, and extreme consequences putting his head in front as they race up towards the line. It's extreme consequences who's taking it up, and he's gonna take it. Extreme consequences takes it, could be a one two for Leon with Dreaming Mist, then Gadebridge and Dance of the Animals, and then Cottage One, and Specky Garson, and Wolverine, and die another day. And Penelope Pitts not pulled up. And. Extreme consequences. That's five out of six, I think. Now looks to be the top of the three-mile hurdle. Is that one? Extreme consequences takes it for Leon van Rensburg. Dreaming mist for Leon again was second. Gadebridge for Darren Thompson the third. Dancer the animals trust was them was fourth. And uh, Specky Garson, the newcomer for John Morgan, hold on to be fifth.